My new novel, The Bee and the Orange Tree, explores the fascinating untold story of the real woman who invented fairy tales. Long before the Brothers Grimm, there was Baroness Marie Catherine Dolnoy, a 17th century French noblewoman whose stories lit up the rather bleak lives of Parisian women who lived under a brutal patriarchal regime. Women were the property of their families and later when they married, became the property of their husbands. They couldn't work, they couldn't inherit wealth. They were dependent upon their male guardians. Marie Catherine was married at 15 to a man 30 years older than her. And when he was imprisoned in the Bastille for treason, she turned to writing fairy tales as a way of carving out an existence. Beneath the layers of loyalty, love and betrayal, Murray Catherine's fairy tales planted a little seed of rebellion in their readers' minds, encouraging women to find a voice. She never stopped believing in trying to improve women's lives. And we have to thank Murray Catherine for creating the portrait of the ideal husband in Prince Charming. The Bee and the Orange Tree takes place over a three month period in this incredible woman's life. When Murray Catherine's best friend, Nicola TK, is accused of trying to assassinate her violent husband. She turns to Marie Catherine to devise a plan for escape. These women went to extraordinary measures to improve their lives. I had so much fun writing The Bee in the Orange Tree and I'm excited that it's in the hands of readers.